Yo, what up? Welcome to Mobox and No Problem. I'm Jose Morris Jr. And today's video, we'll be going over the upcoming fight between Gary Antoine Russell versus Ryan Bertillamy. And everything to know, without further ado, let's get into it. All right, let's begin with the fight poster for the main card, as I couldn't find a specific poster for this undercard. The first thing to note is the fight promoted by TGB Promotions and DSG Promotions. It will air on Showtime in the U.S. on Saturday, July 30th. Gary Antoine Russell will make his return to the ring after a five-month layoff, not having fought since February 26, 2022, in the fight he beat Victor Postal by 10-round TKO. Ryan says Bertillamy will make his return to the ring after an eight-month layoff, his last fight taking place on November 6, 2021, in a TKO victory versus Gustavo Vittori. The fight will be contested at the super lightweight limit of 140 pounds and is scheduled for 10 rounds. The main car fights for the event start at 6 p.m. Pacific, 9 p.m. Eastern, so tune in at that time for this fight as Russell versus Bartolome will be kicking off the telecasts. As for fight location, that'll be at the Barclays Center in Brooklyn, New York. Next, we'll go over the till of the tape. Starting off with the overall record to see how these fighters stack up, Gary Anton Russell has had 15 bouts with the perfect record of 15 wins, no, no losses, no draws, and 15 knockouts. Ryan says Bartolome has had 32 bouts with a record of 29 wins, one loss, no draws, and 15 knockouts. Next, going over the power department, Russell has the edge in power, 100% KO ratio for Russell, compared to Bartolome's 47% KO ratio. As far as physical attributes, the height for both fighters is equal, but Bartolome does enjoy a three and a half inch reach advantage over Russell. As for fighting stance, Russell fights out of the southpaw stance, while Bartolome fights out of the orthodox stance. With regards to their age, Russell is 26 years old, while Bartolome is 37 years old. Russell debuted back in 2017 and has racked up 39 pro rounds, while Bartolome debuted back in 2009 and has accumulated 186 pro rounds. I don't even have to do the math here. <laughs> the editing experience goes to Rances Bartolome. Next, we'll go over the rankings. Starting off with Box Rec, Gary Anton Russell is ranked at number 8, while Rances Bartolome is ranked at number 22. Moving on to the ring rankings, Russell is ranked at number 8, whereas Bertillamy is unranked. And to finish off with the organizational rankings, Gary Anton Russell is ranked by three of the four organizational bodies. He is number 11 by the IBF, number 7 by the WBC, and number 11 by the WBA. Rances Bertillamy is unranked by any of the four major organizational bodies. Next, moving on to the betting odds, which is being brought to you by our sponsor, BetUS. I'll leave a link for them in the description of this video in case you'd like to use them to place your bets for this fight and also take advantage of a sign-up bonus they're offering for my viewers. And as of this video's recording, the odds have not been released, so once these are made public, I will make sure to share those in the comment section of this video. And to finish off, I'll leave you with my prediction, which has me predicting Gary Antoine Russell to win by TKO. Russell is definitely the goods. He's super talented and may very well be the best fighter at 140 pounds eventually. And the just loaded. Rancis Bartolome is a crafty veteran that has never been stopped, but the same could have been said about Russell's last opponent, Victor Postel. Expect Russell to be in complete control of this fight and get a late stoppage to keep his KO streak going. And there you have it. You now know everything you should know about the clean fight between Gary Antoine Russell versus Rancis Bartolome. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, drop a like. And also, please, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Until next time, remember, mo boxing is no problem.